Okay, this is a 206 gauge in Blue Hill, Nebraska. For sale or rent to own. We'll do a walk through here. It's a pretty good size one, especially upstairs. It's got an odd layout, but we'll show you. It's got a big garage on the back. We'll do our walk through here. I don't know what you actually call this. It's got two bedrooms on the main floor, and upstairs has got room for two more. It's got a lot of room up there. Here's what it looks like. It's dirty. They just left it. However, they however it fell and they walked out the door. That's how they left it. This is the living room. There's the heater and the air conditioner for the living room. It's a self-contained unit through the wall. It's a new thing. There's a bedroom. Bunch of junk still in here. Some fish fish equipment, fish tanks. There's a door here to the other bedroom. A little dark in here. That's the door, the other door. They took the door off there to get the, the washer and dryer out. There's the washer and dryer hookups in the back in the closet for this bedroom. And then this is the back into the living room. See there's the two doors for the two bedrooms with the door connecting them. A little hutch built into the wall there. A little tiny closet underneath the stairway. Kitchen is trashed. Cupboards are full. I don't understand. I don't understand that. Full of food still. All kinds of stuff in there. Water heater, fridge. We don't want to open the fridge. We need to just strap it shut and haul it out. Stoves here. There's even dishes in there for you. Uh, bathroom. Here's the bathroom. It's got a shower unit with a door, sliding door here. Let's see. I get a picture here. Now there's the toilet. Looks like a little closet back in here. And there's the uh, back porch area. It's like an air conditioner on the floor there. I don't know what that's about. Here's the breaker box, 100 amp breaker box out here. I think there's another one out in the shop that handles this, the add on up, up top. We'll go upstairs and show you that. I've taken the, uh, the rail, the banister off so they could get stuff out. Person move their stuff back in and put the rail back up. More junk up here. Hardwood floors. Storage areas where the roof attic is here. Big old fan back in there. It's all insulated. Lots of stuff. A bunch of trash bags load this up. Another little storage area. I don't know what that is. This looks like full boxes back there. And I don't know. This could be possibly considered a bedroom. I, I don't know. You come under this part. This is above the kitchen. There's another little storage area. And another one over here. Nothing in there. Okay, this is where it gets odd. They built an addition above the garage. And you walk out across this thing here. This is suspended. There's there's grass below us. I'll walk you outside and show you later. This is what it looks like outside. There's the house and the door to the the door to the uh uh storage room there by the kitchen, that's it. And the garage is back there. And over on this side you see the neighbors. Left a treadmill. And you come back in here, it looks like they had 
another bedroom or even two back in here. I don't know what, what they had going on. Couch, chair, baby crib. Doesn't look like it's in too bad a shape. And a classy vintage lamp for anybody. And then back in here through these the glass doors. Come back in here. This got full uh, full closet. This is a big closet. I don't even want to guess how big this is, but it's got two sets of doors for that closet. This could be a this could be a master bedroom pretty easy. Of course, they got their mattress still up here, a bunch of trash. But besides the trash, it doesn't look too bad in here. Got a mount here for for a TV. Now we'll uh, we'll walk outside and see if uh, see if we can look at the garage. Might as well do it on one video here, so I don't have to upload two of them. Now this is a 206 gauge in Blue Hill, Nebraska, for sale or rent. A rent to own, make some kind of down payment, offer me something, I'm not sure what. Minimum would be one month's rent. One month's rent would be 600 bucks. Here's what I was talking about. That's that walk-in area between that addition above the garage and the house. That's what we got. And then there's a really nice, really nice uh, garage in there. Take a look down here. That's where that bedroom's at up there in the garage. The walkway, the back of the house. Got a bunch of trash still laying here. Show you what the back of the garage looks like. Two car. That one's a big one. Put a pickup or something in there. Automatic openers on the garage. We'll walk in and take a look. I'll open the door here so we get some light. I don't have the electricity turned on, otherwise I would have just hit the button. Now this is all insulated here because they've got that living quarters upstairs. All kinds of junk here. Couches, love feet, tons of junk. And then this here is the area for the second garage, which they framed in a little bit different, but both of them have automatic openers. Lots of room in here, regardless. So, that's 206 gauge in Blue Hill, Nebraska.